All right, hey guys, I'm back. Eddie Gray, Haunted Tank 75. Yada yada, hey. Let me light up real quick. All right, so just made a video. Figured I'd make this other video real quick. I always say real quick, it's never real quick. I'm sorry, guys. This will probably turn into a seven minute video. Maybe I'll surprise myself. <laughs> you see my Weber grill over here. I'm telling y'all, uh, I went for 15 years using the cheapest $89, $99 special I could find. A Weber grill is where it's at. I've had this one for two years. It's dirty, I need to clean it, but I mean, it's still working like a champ. consistent not rusting out like those old rust buckets I used to buy and throw away every two to three years it stays outside in the elements I have a cover for it but I don't use it <laughs> I did for the first year but the cover gets nasty and you don't want to screw with it anyway today I'm smoking my Molina pipe. Kind of looks like a tree trunk. You see that um, crazy etching on it? I mean, it looks and feels like a tree trunk. It really doesn't feel like briar, but it's got, uh, I can't imagine what else it would be. But it's blacked out all around, and the bowl was, you know, pre treated. So I can't guarantee you that it's briar, but. Uh, It is a 9mm pipe, and it smokes very well. Oh, I'm missing a meeting at work right now. <laughs> Get rid of that notification. In it today, I am smoking some... Uh, what is this? Potlatch. Seattle Pipe Club's pipe, pot, Potlatch. And I've had varying degrees of satisfaction with this uh, tobacco. Tobacco, I can't talk today. Depending on the, the pipe that I smoke it in. Now, what I wanted to talk to you about today is filter pipes, specifically nine millimeter filter pipes. Um, and even more specifically, uh, charcoal 9 millimeter filter pipes. That's what this is. This Molina pipe is an, fits a 9 millimeter right here. You see the shanks pretty big right there. Um, and when I first got into the pipe uh, collecting craze about two years ago, three years ago, um, I was very interested in filter pipes, and I, a lot of the pipes I bought were filter pipes. Um, and I figured, you know, if I if I don't like them, I don't have to use them, you know. Which I found to be true enough. Um, so you know, the thrifty part of me quit using them. I was like, I'll save them. I've I've got some stored up here, maybe 50 of them, but I haven't been using them, and uh, it's funny that um, the other day I did a first smoke in my new Stanwell Pipe of the Year, and if you watch that video, you'll see me light up that pipe with Carter Hall, I mean just Carter Hall, man, I mean just standby nothing to bowl you over with flavor but uh, you'll see me take a a double take at the pipe and, and kind of remark on how good it tasted and I thought well maybe it's just because <laughs> I didn't have time to think about it on camera but afterwards I got to thinking about it and I, you know I was I was thinking at the time well maybe it's just because I haven't smoked anything in a couple of days and it really tastes good because of that.
but I think I figured out what it is. And I'm going to be testing this. I'm curious to know your thoughts on it. Um, when I first started buying cob pipes, um, you know, of course they come with the, the little white paper Dr. Grabo filters or Medico filters, but they're just paper, paper filters. And uh, they're cheap, they get wet and soggy, and in my opinion, they don't do anything. That's just my experience with it. Um, I started for a while buying the Savinelli six millimeter filters, the balsa wood filters, and putting them in my cob pipes. And of course I used them in my Savinelli's until I got lazy and quit using filters altogether. I think the balsa wood filters work better. You can reuse them, they don't get super nasty. I mean, you can use them, uh, I would say three times. Other people use them more than that before they throw them out. Um, I think they're a decent filter. Um, but the nine millimeter filters, this is my experience. And again, I would like to hear other people's experience in the community, but looking back at that video, just really solidified for me. Uh, when I got done with it, I finished that that uh, smoke and that new Stanwell, smoked that Carter Hall all the way down to the bottom, which I rarely have that experience myself. And uh, it stayed lit well, burned cool. And uh, when I got done with it, it struck me, this is a filter pipe. I bought the nine millimeter filter version of this pipe of the year. And sure enough, when it cooled down, I took the shank, or I took the stem off and there was a Stanwell filter in it from when I bought it. And I forgot that that filter was in there. And I really think that was a big part, I mean a big part of why that smoke was so enjoyable um, so from my experience, and it's, it's staying true here, I've got a filter in this pipe now. Nine millimeter charcoal filter pipes are uh, where it's at for me. Um, and I think back to the most enjoyable smokes I've had, they tend to be primarily in those types of pipes with filter involved. Um, so the benefits, they smoke cooler. Uh, they're easier to light and stay lit. They remove, you know, some of the nasties that you don't want uh, from the smoke. And they keep all the taste. I mean, that's been my experience. Maybe it's different with aromatics. But like that Carter Hall, um, um, it's topped with something, but it's not, you know, it's not what I would call an aromatic. But in my experience with filter pipes, with Englishes and natural blends and that kind of stuff, all the flavors there, uh, the filter doesn't do anything to take away from that. And uh, just really helps the smoke um, stay dry and all kinds of stuff. I mean, it, it really seems to help me. So. I'm going to be comparing smoking 9mm pipes with and without the filter over the next week or two and um, hopefully I'll give you all an update on that. But uh, I think I'm onto something there for me, not for everybody. But uh, if you have trouble with any of those things, keeping your pipe lit, uh, lighting your pipe in general, um, pipes not smoking cool. Uh, all that kind of stuff. Try a 9mm filter pipe. And if you have one and you just threw the filter out when you first bought it, get your filter, put it in there, and let us know what you think. Alright y'all, we'll chat with you later.